Hello everyone. Today we will learn something about how to write airlines resume. Myself Anjali Tomar, HR manager at Air Cruise Aviation Private Limited. So what is a resume? A resume is also known as CV, a document created and used by a person to present their background skills and accomplishments it is used for various purposes especially while applying for jobs it is also used to represent oneself types of resumes first chronological it includes a list of previous jobs in order functional resume it mainly focuses on skills and experience targeted resumes it is tailored to a specific job combination resume it is a blend of chronological and functional elements chronological resume first it is most commonly used second it is the most preferred by employers third it is chronological in order with the most recent ones on the top who should use first people with solid work experience second it should be aligned with the job specifications third without any type of lapse termination between employments functional resume it focuses on your skills and experience first it is not emphasized on dates you have worked employment history is considered secondary and is listed under skills who should use it people with lapse between employments middle of a career transition recent graduate with limited work experience also diverse background with no specific career path combination resume details of both skills as well as experience backing up with chronological order of work history it is flexible in nature who should use it if you want to give a detail about your work experience or if you want to show what kind of employee you are targeted resume it is a customized resume which is in detail to the prospective job that you are seeking qualifications to educational experience actually mirrors the job requirements who should use it it is used to generate the best results as the qualifications and experience you outline mirror the prospective job opening closely when you develop a targeted resume you need to be as accurate as possible and not embellish career highlights simply to mirror the job resume for airline industry the format most preferred or used format which is reverse chronological other review formats you could try are first functional resume got the required skills but not the work experience second combination resume which focuses on both skills and your work experience additional info which is quite optional first awards and certification second languages and third interests and hobbies things that should be or to be included and avoided in your resume first photo a passport photo with professional attire 
up to shoulder height. And not a holiday photo or any other casual or informal or unprofessional attire. Second, statistics. Some airlines also require members of the cabin crew to be a certain height, so as to make sure to include these details. Also, add other specific details that are relevant to the job application, such as any extra languages that you speak and maybe your swimming ability. Professional profile. First, it should be a concise introduction that is brief and to the point. At the top of your CV, usually around 75 to 125 words in length. Second, about yourself and what would you offer. Third, example, customer service skills or previous working routes. What you should avoid, being vague or irrelevant. And also ensure your professional profile is specific to the aviation industry you are applying for. Work experience. Add a work experience section. Use bullet points and describe about your work experience. Relevant responsibilities and achievements rather than everything in detail. If you are new to the industry, start with your educational qualifications and identify your transferable experiences and skills and focus on those. Education and qualifications. Include any qualifications you have achieved starting with your most recent alongside the dates attended and the college or university names mentioned. Specify any certifications or licenses you possess that are required for the job. Any training you have undertaken that is relevant to the industry. Embark on new training courses and acquire new skills relevant to the industry. Skills to be reflected in the resume of aviation industry. First, Customer service. In this industry, it is fundamentally about providing a positive, pleasant experience for customers while ensuring their safety. Demonstrate your skills in a highly effective manner and not just mention about it. Communication. You will be required to communicate safety or emergency procedures to passengers in a clear manner and with your colleagues to ensure the efficiency of cabin tasks. Second, demonstrate your communication skills to draw attention to both your work and non-work activities. Professionalism, the face of the airline. You will play a key role in determining what customers think of the airline, highlighting specific experiences where you demonstrated your professionalism in such situations. Teamwork. To draw attention to your teamworking skills, you might want to describe your experiences outside of the employment. From captaining your local rugby team to success or collaborating with fellow students during a group project at university. Adaptability. A significant number of off days in comparison to the average office worker who gets around 96 days off per day. Adaptable with regards to their plans at home. Flight delays are not uncommon and one should be prepared to make changes to their plans at short notice. Demonstrate your ability, adaptability in your CV by specifying times when you acquired new skills to perform new tasks, took on your responsibilities or developed alternative solutions 
two problems. Tips for your resume. For applicants with prior flight attendant experience. If you were previously employed as a flight attendant or have experience in a related field, you can post the following. First, experienced and outgoing professional seeking a position as a flight attendant with say XYZ Airlines, where I can utilize my diverse customer service skills and demonstrate my calm and reassuring demeanor in emergency situations. Energetic, friendly, customer-oriented professional looking to fill the flight attendant position with XYZ Airlines. Reliable, outgoing, professional seeking a flight attendant position with XYZ Airlines, providing extensive communication skills, a friendly, calm, and confident personality to maximize safety and comfort of passengers, and an unwavering patience for passengers who need additional assistance. Experienced professional seeking a senior flight attendant position with XYZ Airways, offering impeccable customer service skills, a friendly, charming, and warm personality, a can-do attitude, and previously demonstrated ability to stay calm and assist passengers even in an emergency landing situation. For entry-level applicants, if you are seeking an entry-level flight attendant position and have no relevant work experience, you can use the following descriptions in your CV. First, outgoing, reliable, professional, seeking an entry-level position in the airline industry where my hospitality and customer service skills will be put to good use. Seeking an entry-level position in the airline field for implementation of my optimistic and customer-centered method. Responsible individual looking to fill the position for a flight attendant with XYZ airline, eager to learn and ready to work hard to attain customer satisfaction through the utilization of my dynamic and warm personality and customer service protocols. Looking to obtain a position in the airline industry where my warm and accommodating personality can best serve customers. Young professional seeking the flight attendant position with the XYZ Airlines where I can build upon my knowledge of customer service and the airline industry while also ensuring each passenger's needs are met and their experience is satisfactory. Conclusion. You can get a lot of online platforms where you can get your CV templates. Keeping in view the above discussed points, you can prepare your resume as per your job requirements. Avoid irrelevant or vague topics to your job requirements. Be precise and very concise to the point in describing yourself. Thank you.